else they can play, right? So the disco was taking up too much space for me. And a lot of radio stations that would play hard rock, all of a sudden, the next week, they'd say, oh, we don't play hard rock anymore. We're now a disco station. And then I'd give them my new song. They'd say, no, we, we, it's too heavy for us. That, my whole life, I heard that with my songs. It's too heavy for us. That used to make me so angry. I wrote this song called One Way to Rock. It's like there's only one way to rock, Jackie. You know, if you either you rock or you don't. Don't be calling yourselves the rock of the Bay, the rock of St. Louis, the rock of, you know, New York, you know, the rock of Munich, you know. Don't be calling yourself that if, if, and playing the wrong, and playing the Bee Gees. underground New York scene at Max's Kansas City and at CBGB's with the New York Dolls and the Ramones and Wayne County and Patti Smith and Cherry Vanilla and that whole crew who were all being ignored by radio and by mainstream music media because of disco. <laughs> really I seized on the elements in that editorial I manufactured and sold death to disco buttons and bumper stickers in 1976 all over the country through magazines at the biggest clubs. I wrote a song in about 10 or 15 minutes of rhymes uh, extolling the virtues of the New York rock scene and how it was suffering at the hands of all these mindless disco records. Death to I'm attacking Barry White and Donna Summer. I could have easily made a record that said Disco Stinks and got on the radio, but I didn't. I said, try your luck, don't get fucked by Disco, it sucks, because I wanted to make a statement reflecting the passion that I felt. Rock was the music that was used to engineer women's rights, the civil rights movement, gay rights, every kind of right. And then rock had its last rights, and disco came along, and was just mindless and fun. The record became very successful. We were invited onto the Don Imus TV show, which was a national show. That seemed to spark it even further. Within a year, other records started to pop up, I think, using that element. I mean, come on, with the, the, the dress and the leisure suits and the hairdos and the, the marketing. You know, they were selling products associated with the disco movement from, from clothing to hair preparations to whatever the case may be. It was becoming a machine. Dance. 